Today we'll be making a guitar pick bracelet. In your kit, you should have a guitar pick and two shorter strands of string. You will need those to make your bracelet. You're going to take one strand of string and thread it through the hole at one end of your guitar pick. Make sure your guitar pick is in the very middle of the string. You will then tie an overhand knot and tighten it, making sure the knot is as close to the guitar pick as you can get it. You will repeat this on the other side using your other piece of string. Pull your knots nice and tight. Loop the strands of string around to form your bracelet. You will take the string from one side and tie it to the string from the other side using an overhand knot. You will do the same thing with the other piece of string. So you will tie it to the string from the other side using an overhand knot. You'll notice that the knots will slide along the string. That is what's going to make your bracelet adjustable so you can get it off and on and wear it nice and tight. You can also tie overhand knots in the ends of each of the four strands to make sure they don't fray. And that is how you make a simple guitar pick bracelet. Next, we will be making a square knot bracelet. For this, you will need the two strands of longer string and the bead from your kit. Take your two strands of string together and fold them in half. Tie a knot in the string, forming a loop so the four ends of the string all hang down. You'll want your loop to be big enough for your bead to pass through as this is how your bracelet will open and close. Tape the loop down to a table or a hard surface so you can keep tension in your string as you're tying knots. To set up the square knot, you'll want one strand of string to the left, one to the right, and two strands hanging down the middle. To tie the square knot, take the left hand string and put it across the top of the two middle strands in a four shape and take the right hand string and bring it underneath the two strands in the middle to make a four shape and bring it up through the four on the left. You will pass the end of the string from the left down the four on the right. Pull this knot tight. You will repeat this on the other side, though this time the string on the right will make the four on top, 
and the string on the left will make the four on the bottom. Bring the end of the string from the left up through the four on the right, and bring the end of the string on the right down through the four shape on the left. Tighten the knot. We'll go through that one more time. Take the string on the left and put it in a four shape across the top of the strands in the middle. Then bring the string from the right underneath the strands in the middle and up through the four on the left. Put the end of the strand from the left down the four on the right. Pull your knot tight. Once your bracelet is your desired length, put your beads on the end, string all four strands of string through the bead, and tie a knot to keep the bead in place. Trim the ends as needed. And untape your bracelet from the flat surface. The bead in the loop will be the clasp on your bracelet and it is all ready to wear.